तो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द प्रॉब्लम 238 लीड कोड प्रोडक्ट ऑफ एरे एक्सेप्ट सेल सो दिस प्रॉब्लम स्टेट्स दैट वी आर गिवन एन एरे नम्स एंड वी नीड टू फाइंड द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ ऑल द एलिमेंट्स इनसाइड द इनसाइड द एरे फॉर देयर रिस्पेक्टिव एलिमेंट एंड लाइक द प्रोडक्ट शुड बी ऑफ ऑल द एलिमेंट्स एक्सेप्ट द एलिमेंट इट सेल्फ सो इफ यू सी एट रिजल्टेंट एरे द रिजल्ट द जीरो इंडेक्स ऑफ द रिजल्टेंट एरे इज द प्रोडक्ट ऑफ ऑल द एलिमेंट्स Except the zeroth element itself. So this here is the result. The product of these elements here is the result. Similarly, the result, uh, the second, uh, the first index result is the product of all the elements except element two itself, right? So let's look at the approach first, and then we'll go to the code. Um, so for this problem, we are going to create two different arrays. One is the prefix, uh, the prefix array. The other is the postfix array. so the prefix product array the prefix product array that will create first will determine the product of all the elements that come before the element so uh, the zeroth index of the prefix array will always by default be 1 now the first index so the first index of the prefix array will signify the product of all the elements that come before the first element so the product of all the elements that come before the first index element is 1 itself so we'll put here 1 now now the product of all the elements that come before this index is 2 2 into 1 so we'll put it we'll put here 2 similarly the product of all the elements that come before this element so the product is 6 so we'll put here 6 so this is a prefix now we will calculate the postfix so the postfix will travel in reverse right so again the last element of the postfix product array will be by default 1 now this uh, the second last element the second last element will be the product of all the elements that come after this element that's why it is postfix right post is post after pre is before so the product of all the elements that come after this index is 4 so we'll put here 4 now the product of all the elements that come after this is 12 so we'll put here 12 now the product of all the elements that come after this is 24 so we'll put here 24 so this is a postfix now why we have why we have calculated prefix array and postfix array right see um, we want the resultant array to be product of all the elements except the element itself that includes the product of all the elements that come before the element and product of all the elements that come after the element right and this is what we have computed right now so we have product of all the elements that come before the element itself like if we consider two here so we have product of all the elements that come before the element itself that is here and we have product of all the elements that come after the element itself that we have here now all we need to do to get the resultant array is for each index for each index we need to multiply their prefix and postfix element value and we will get the resultant array So if you multiply here, twenty-four into one is twenty-four. So the first element will be twenty-four. Similarly, second element will be twelve into one, twelve. Third element will be four into two, eight. And the last element will be six into one, six. And if you check, this is our answer. Right. So now let's code this approach up. So we will have three arrays: one for postfix, one for prefix, and one for resultant. So I'll we'll create three arrays. Uh, so this will be. First will be res. Make int and this will be length of length nums. Similarly, pre make int length nums and post make int length nums. Right. Now we will traverse the first. uh we will traverse the element traverse the array and create a prefix array so we know that prefix array first element will be always one so we will traverse from one this will be this will go to length nums i plus plus and will pre i will be pre i minus 1 into nums i minus 1 right so suppose we are at index 1 then pre i will be pre i minus 1 into num i minus 1 so that means 1 into 1 which is 1 if we are at here then this will be pre i minus 1 into num i minus 1 1 into 2 which is 
we are at if we are in index 3 then uh, pre 3 will be pre i minus 1 into nums i minus 1 which is 6 3 into 2 is 6 so this is 6 right similarly we will calculate for post so we know post element last element post array last element will be 1 so we will traverse the array now for i equal to length nums minus 2 i greater than equal to 0 i minus minus similarly post i will be post i plus 1 into nums i plus 1 now since now we have our pre array we have a post array let's calculate finally our res array so res array will be i equal to 0 i less than length nums i plus plus res i will be product of pre i and post i finally we will return our s now let's run this up and see if it works uh, so there is an error okay i need to put here minus minus i'll run this again now and the test pass i'll submit it and it does work so this is all for now and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much.